Hey, this is Brian Rogers from the BBK, R&D, and Technical Support Departments here to show you our stainless steel full-length headers and matching mid-pipes for C5 and C6 Corvette and Z06 models. All of these units feature our new zero-reduction collectors for maximum flow. These systems are available with high-flow catalytic converters or as straight off-road pipes. The installation is very straightforward and it's a relatively simple bolt-on with no cutting or welding required. With the negative battery terminal disconnected, unplug the oxygen sensors and drop the wiring harnesses down. Unbolt the mid-pipe from the stock exhaust manifolds and the tailpipes. Then unbolt the mid-pipe from the hangers. Use caution because the stock mid-pipe is quite heavy. Once you get the mid-pipe off, remove the oxygen sensors from the mid-pipe. Under the hood, remove the decorative engine covers, spark plug wires, spark plugs, and the dipstick tube on the passenger side, then disconnect the EGR and air tubes on models that are equipped with those to get access to the stock manifolds. Use the factory belt tensioner to release the accessory belt so it can be pulled off of the alternator pulley. Then unbolt the alternator and either set it on top of the bracket or completely remove it from the car. Now simply unbolt and remove the manifolds and gaskets from the top on both sides of the engine. Remove the bottom cover plate from the middle of the car and use the template in the instruction sheet to punch a few holes in it for the oxygen sensor harnesses. You'll be rerouting them and plugging in the oxygen sensor extensions in order to keep the harnesses off of the headers and the mid-pipes. With the plate reinstalled, you can now put the BBK headers in place by pushing them up from underneath the car. An assistant with a helpful hand in the engine compartment could make this part a little bit easier. Drop the supplied gaskets into place and bolt the BBK headers up to the heads. Once the headers are tightened up, reattach the air and EGR fittings to the BBK headers and reassemble everything you removed under the hood. Now swap the front oxygen sensors from the stock manifolds over to the BBK headers, tighten them and plug them in. The rear oxygen sensors will be hanging down and the best way to work that out is to thread them into the pipe by spinning the pipe itself. Once they are fully in, snug them with a wrench and this keeps the harnesses from getting twisted up. From here, place the mid pipes up to the collectors on the headers and finger tighten the hardware to keep it in place while you line up the rest of the exhaust system. Slide the supplied clamps over the pipes and slip fit the X section onto the rear. To wrap up the installation, just bolt up the tailpipe section and the hangers. Now just simply go back and tighten all of the hardware you've just installed and keep in mind that it's always best to come back after the first 100 miles and re-tighten those header bolts. As you can see here, we put maximum consideration into ground clearance with excellent results. The BBK system installs neat and tidy. Speed bumps will never be a problem with this system. Now let's take this mildly modified C5 to the dyno to see how the BBK headers and exhaust system improve the performance overall. Well, just as we suspected, the BBK headers and high flow catted X pipe allow this LS engine in the Corvette to breathe to its full potential and help unleash that horsepower that's trapped inside the stock system. For more information on this or any of the hundreds of parts that BBK makes for late model cars and trucks, check out BBKPerformance.com where you can search for parts directly for your vehicle or search by product category. At BBKPerformance.com you can also watch fun and informative product detail and installation videos or download instruction sheets. If you're looking for a local distributor in your area, you can find that on our website too with our dealer locator. BBKPerformance.com even has a library of magazine articles from years of independent testing for you to review. And while you're there, don't forget to check out the BBK homepage and blog to see what's new. Thanks for watching.